Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover HTTP response. Uh, here you can see the client machine and here you can see the server. Uh, server is nothing but a machine which hosts the website. Uh, the client send HTTP request to the server. Server will uh, process the HTTP request and it will send uh, HTTP response back to the client. Okay. Uh, now we will see how the HTTP response message uh, looks like. Okay. Uh, so this is how uh, uh, response message uh, looks like and it has uh, four parts uh, the first one is uh, status line and uh, the second part is uh, header fields uh, header has uh, three types the first one is uh, general header the second one is uh, response header and the third one is uh, entity header okay and uh, third part is uh, empty line or blank line indicating end of the header fields and the fourth part is optional uh, message body okay and we will see some uh, sample HTTP response so this one is a sample HTTP response uh, the first line is uh, status line and uh, from date to this uh, connection is uh, response header and then you can see the empty line so indicate uh, header fields uh, is uh, finished and uh, remaining part is uh, message body okay so 200 okay means uh, the server uh, process the HTTP request successfully and uh, it sends uh, a success message to the client okay uh, this is the second uh, sample uh, HTTP response uh, the first line is uh, status line and from date to this uh, content type is uh, uh, header information this is nothing but uh, response header information and uh, then there is a blank line indicating uh, end of the header fields uh, then uh, uh, message body okay so here it, you can see a 404 not found meaning client has sent the request to the server for the particular uh, resource the server uh, uh, could not find that particular resource okay then it sends uh, 404 not found uh, message to the uh, client okay uh, now we will see the detail about the status line uh, status line has three parts the first one is uh, HTTP version, the second one is uh, status code, and the third one is uh, recent phrase. Okay, and uh, this is a sample uh, status line. So you can see HTTP uh, version is 1.1, and uh, status code is uh, 404, and uh, recent phrase is uh, not found. Okay, and uh, there are uh, five types of uh, status codes are there. Uh, the first one is uh, 100 series and the second one is 200 series and the third one is 300 series and the fourth one is 400 series and uh, fifth one is uh, 500 series okay so 100 uh, series means it is informational uh, this means uh, uh, request is uh, received uh, by the server and it is uh, continuing the process okay and uh, 200 series means uh, successful uh, meaning uh, uh, the request is successfully received by the server and it is understood and it is accepted okay and uh, third one is 300 series meaning uh, redirection so in order to complete the request uh, the further action is uh, required okay so that is the meaning of uh, 300 series and uh, fourth one is uh, 400 series uh, meaning client error so the client send some request to the server right so the request contains uh, bad syntax so it cannot be fulfilled okay uh, the fifth one is uh, 500 series uh, that is server error so the request is uh, uh, proper but uh, server cannot able to process the request some problem in uh, code or something so it throws the uh, server error to the client okay Uh, now we will see the detailed information about the header fields uh, like I mentioned there are uh, uh, three header fields are there the first one is uh, 
general header field second one is uh, response header fields and uh, third one is entity header fields first we will see the response header fields so these are the sample uh, response header fields so using this uh, response header fields server can send additional information about the response to the client also server can send additional information about the server to the client okay and uh, next one is uh, entity header fields uh, these are the sample entity header fields uh, so this entity header fields define meta information about the message body or entity body okay and uh, next one is uh, general header fields uh, these are the sample uh, general header fields so uh, this general header fields will applicable to uh, both request and uh, response messages okay and uh, this is about uh, http response uh, and uh, thanks for watching bye